Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb. Welcome back to this Let's Play of U4 as Congo. And we are in a rather brutal war with Ethiopia. They're gonna die. We are having quite a few rebel issues here and there. Uh, is that a fort? No. Why do I have a fort symbol then? Hmm. Actually move like this. Or are you gonna move there? No. You're not. This fort is gonna fall, that fort is gonna fall too. Everything's all fine and dandy. We killed the rebels down here, fantastic. Now, unsiege these back, if you please. Oh, and I probably should start considering uh, recovering from my rebels. I do have quite a few of them. Ethiopia, oddly enough, has not sent. Uh, peace deals as far as I've noticed. Uh, right now my concern is Alodia. We are gonna get awfully close to the... Well, there's the offer uh, from Ethiopia. We are gonna get awfully close to the... Uh, the! <laughs> the! This the! But they are suffering some kind of weird malady. See? 74 mercs. Their manpower has not gone up at all. Their army size is stable, so they must be... They must have parked their entire army in one province and they must be attritioning like crazy. Which I don't mind, but... It wouldn't surprise me if their entire army is trapped over in Nogai. Or something. That could actually be it. That could be it. Let's see, who do you have military access through? To Iraq, and you have access through Iraq, well that's it. Your mission has switched to conquer Crete. Who holds Crete? That's Venice. Yeah, you're gonna steamroll that. Uh, did I move my troops out of uh, Cusco? I did. Thank you for your military access, my friend. I don't need it anymore. Should get rid of this warning. Excellent. Slowly taking control of rebels and everything else. Siege here is done. Excellent. Now we just need the diplomats back. So the plan: we're gonna force vassalize uh, Alodia. Then we're going to return tons of territory to them from Medribahi. After we've forced uh, converted them, I think. Yeah. We'll see. We'll do mean things. Mean, mean things. Let's go there. 914. Yeah, all of them are 914, right? Yeah. Good. And after all of this, we have to start uh, killing down our rebels. And basically, uh, slow down a little bit. Uh, Gero, that's... yeah, that was on here, good. And these were the ones that were called uh, Adrian's cores, so let's switch back to Adrian. Kaffa's cores are where? There. Thought we had more cores than that, but okay. That goes to Kaffa. That goes to Kaffa. At the very least. And Lodia has all of those cores. Lovely. That provided, of course, I can do this in this one war. Uh, about to see. About to find out. So, Elodia, you... You're gonna be my vassal. You give me, give me all your money. Because I need your money. It's going to cost us 54 diplomatic points. But I'm okay with that. It is going to push, push, us, push us over the, uh, the 
subject limit, but that's fine. Immediately I'm gonna go to Elodia and say, you know what? Uh, their opinion must be positive. Well, boo. Okay. That's gonna take a while then. Uh, recall the one from the Ottomans. We have pressing things to deal with then. Actually, you're marching through there, so... There we go, that's gonna be full occupation. And that does not bring Alodia in on this war. No, it doesn't. So I can't give them territory that easily in this war. Well, I can, but it's gonna cost points. And if I wait until their relations are high enough, you know, that's not going to happen either. Regency Council. Dear, poor you. Uh, yeah, so if I wanted to give territory back to Elodia, that's going to cost diplomatic points. And not overly much, though. And yeah, I definitely don't want to Kaffa. Um... Now I wish I'd put you as co belligerent it would have been helpful. Clear the offer. Um, release stations, no. You are going to return this to Kaffa. And there's no way for me to just take it and not avoid penalty, right? No, don't see that to Kaffa. Is it, is it the same cost? Let's see, if I take the province, that is going to be 13 war score and 8 diplomacy. If I return, that's going to be 10 war score and 8 diplomacy. Okay, in that case we're going to return it because that's going to be cheaper. Um, let's see, let's start at the top here. Uh, oh my goodness pronunciation of these things. Wait. Yeah, there we go. Sara Nubia. That's Sara Nubia. Uh, Dongora. Actually, no. Go Berber. And Beha. And then Al Kirif. And Fasinguli, if that's on the list. It is not. So, which provinces do you actually claim? That's these, which we just asked them to return. And if I said that this should go to Kaffa. You'd be willing to accept that. Fifty-two points so far. Um, not so bad. That's your capital, I assume. Probably. Um, Senar. Tolodia. And that's it. Okay. That's a pretty sizable chunk of land. Katsina and Mali, they pretty much hate my guts anyway. 70 Diplo points, that's a bit unfortunate, but I'm gonna deal with that, I think. I suppose I should have taken these rather than the inland, but that's okay. Yeah. The good thing is that now we can actually uh, vacate this area. You're gonna move south. You. Oh, yeah, I don't actually have. Oh. Right, that's not the coastal. Um, yeah, okay, make sure that all my armies are within Ethiopian territory at the very least before I make the peace, otherwise I'll be landlocked here. 
That would be bad. And now we have quite a few rebels to deal with. We have one that's about to fire... Uh, several that actually. Particularists. Thought they were already... Uh, yeah, they're already risen. Now they all fire again. Not sure what's going on there. This is gonna go to Ajuran. So... If I put down like this, that's gonna cost... nothing. Again, I wanna test this. Uh, it looks like the numbers are different, so... I want to be sure, sure that... I don't misunderstand this. Barawa! Can I sort them by alphabet? There we go. Barawa, which is the war goal. Seven points, nothing if I do a return course. Uh, return course, then it costs nine. So yeah, you're gonna return all of these. Let's see, which else? That's Ajiran. Wasn't this also Ajiran's core? It is, so we're gonna give that to Ajiran as well. The rest aren't. Of course, you're gonna give this back to Kaffa. You're more than happy to do that. Oh, I assume that's gonna cost me points then. Yeah, okay, so Kaffa costs points. Let's see how much the difference is. Or Ilubatu, there you go. Ilubatu costs 7 more score and 13 different points this way. If I'm gonna do return core, then it'll cost far less. And it won't cost points. Huh. You as a subject state. Yes, I like the idea of that. I very much like the idea of that. Though after this piece, you're probably gonna be rather annoyed with me. Let's see now, Kaffa, you have taken at least one province that wasn't a core. Adrian has taken nothing. I can give these two to Adrian. So, yeah. Um, let's see again. Weren't these claims... This one's one of his cores. This is his... Huh? Did I make that a part of the beast deal already? No, there we go. These two. I have to take them now and call them myself. Still a fair bit of points. Alternatively, if I hand them over to another state, that's gonna cost me Diplo points. Both now and when I integrate them. Okay, next level. Uh, we're gonna go for cultures, cultures, cultures. Next level thinking. I want him to convert provinces for me, right? So, I want to see... If I can find cultures... There we go, accepted cultures for you. Or culture map rather than general. These are all your culture, these are your culture group. You should have an easier time converting all of that. Really? Small is in the same group, okay. Interesting. Uh, 
And you're gonna have a heck of a time, you're gonna have a lot of provinces, but they are your cores, you shouldn't have too much of an issue with that. Uh, these I can't give away just yet. These I'd have to give away. That's his capital. I'm gonna shift control to Kaffa just because I wanna see the cost. Sixteen points now. And more later. Let's strengthen Kaffa a little bit. Thing is though, if I don't take these provinces, I'll have to make my subjects fabricate claims on Ethiopia. Or I can attack this little guy and... Hmm. Yeah! Yeah, that little guy. Let's move our troops over in this direction. I don't have a CB though. Or do I? Uh, probably not. No CB. Uh, I'd have to take land closer to you in order to be able to do that. So, I'd have to take... Actually, I need one of the bridge lands here in order to fabricate around there. Or I could take one province from Ethiopia now and fabricate from that. I could take Socotra. Yeah, let's... Give me Socotra. Then I can fabricate off of Socotra and declare it that way. Great Britain is no longer a valid rival, really. Oh my. It's gonna give us that for a little bit of time. Are there any other countries that are valid rivals? I am gonna bet a billion dollars that's gonna be uh, Russia. Because that, that's the only country I'm interested in allying. So that's going to be guaranteed be the nation that's going to be at adds odds with us. Um, yeah, I want you to be within Ethiopia when we make peace. Because then I can actually get you out of this mess. Hopefully. We're going to arrive on the 23rd. No, first, okay, November 1st, then we're going to make peace. Then we're going to start sailing uh, towards warmer shores. Okay. You're there, so now you'll be exiled. I will strengthen Adridant more, I think. You know what? Yeah, let's give these up to Adridant just to want to see. Oh, I can only take one of them. Well, then, I st then I'll still have a claim on you. That's okay, too. And that costs me quite a lot of points, actually. Yeah, but that's okay. We're gonna weaken you quite a bit. Gonna take your money as well. Actually... Yeah, your money. Ah, oh, you didn't have that much. Well, in that case, I still want that to be done. Yeah, you're gonna enter coalition mode, but that's fine. You can't answer to that for a long time. And they're gonna be happy, hopefully. So let's do this. And don't move through... No, 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 don't move through Kaffa. Because then you'll be... Uh, Reflagged. Let's go down there. To the coast. You... 
are going to march here. And meet up with them. We're going to march straight to the coast. So now we have Sokotra. Core it. Reduce the unrest. I think that was the only promise we actually took. The rest of them are our subject states. Yeah. And we're gonna, immediately going to fabricate on this little feller, since he's still not willing to become subject states. And we're going to be a subject by other means. And we're going to improve relations with... Oh, we don't have to anymore. Adodia loves us right now. You're not going to love me when I do this. There we go. And suddenly I cannot rival whoever, whomever I had as an option. Ah oh well. Fine by me. Pro relations with our errant subjects. Oh yeah, the other subject. We could now start integrating. If they liked us enough. Fine, I'm going to prioritize, prioritize that then. Since we are above the subject limit, right? Or the relationship limit. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I'm going to need to boost relations with you after all. Lost a claim on Mogadishu. Which is fine, we just... Yeah, <laughs> that's very much fine. You're gonna arrive on the 16th. There you go, you are aboard, good. Set sail, because we have rebellions to kill. I move here, and then... Yeah, where are you relocating? Biafada. Really? Okay. There we go. Peace in our time. And now we have to see if we can get <laughs> this stuff. Uh, uh, settle down. Need to make him like us. That shouldn't be too difficult. And they still haven't done anything here, which really boggles the mind. On the level of tech, military tech, yes, yes, yes. Uh, do we have a spy network? Yeah, the Congolese spy network was beaten back. I could try to... Wait. I'm gonna wait, because... Oh, darn it. You really can't deal with your Separatists, can you? I'm gonna have to put a leader in charge over here and try to help out. As for our mission, what did we take? Yeah, France. That's... Okay, we're gonna keep buttering up to France. That should work. gonna take a while. There we go. The particularists has, have arrived. And right, we wanted to build more ships. We have 12, we're building 15, we need three more. So, one, two, three. And then we're gonna upgrade the others, if we can afford it. We'll see. And we have to gonna, gonna have to save up money for that. You too, you're gonna march clear across Africa. Let's see, we have different cruises now, right? But the Dubai is 90 and the other one 91. Yeah, that's fine. No rush. No rush on that front. Oh yeah, I have a throwaway troop on the Comoris. I forgot about that one. 
Uh, reduce uproar. 10 unrest. Or... Um, rebels. Gonna go for the rebels, and we locked out! Troop transports. Since that destination province is now occupied, we don't seem to care. Oh well. One rebellion at a time. Oh, they moved there now. Let's see if we can help our colonial state survive the l land I gave them. L -l -l land. There we go. When you're colonizing rather rapidly, I don't like this. We'll have to take this and then probably that, because they're gonna get here before we can close the gap. Yeah, Mali is fabricating on us. Big woohoo. Big shock there. They're still not friends with anyone. And a second circumnavigation. I'll take that. Ain't the first, but at least sec being second ain't bad. And we helped our subject kill rebels. Yay, excellent. And... Why? Oh. Because I surpassed France, right? I surpassed... Uh, yeah, I surpassed Britain, so we no longer have common rivals. <sighs> Sending a gift ain't gonna happen. Uh, they will not give... Uh, they don't give a damn about military access. And I guarantee it's only plus 10. So, yeah. Damn it. So much for that mission. Recall the diplomat. Normally I'm glad when I surpass a rival, but... Yeah. Boo. Protect the autonomy. Big deal. At least we'll be able to start integrating one of our subjects very soon here. And thank goodness for that. Alright, oh, a colonist is free. Better send them into the interior. Please don't take 600 and something days. Yeah. I really hate this one, but okay. At least it occupies the province. So that he can't send anyone in. And Taglock should finish soon. Speaking of, there we go. <laughs> I think we're gonna do that. I want to be sure I don't have any contention down there. You took this province, huh? I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. And Brittany has showed up. <laughs> oh boy. Brittany, seriously, keep, can't you stay in, stay up in uh, Canada? Uh, that means you have colonial range from here to there. Oh, holy, holy mother. Uh, that, or you did something sneaky, like settle down here. Yeah, you did, didn't you? Ah. And I haven't seen the Ottomans settle anything for a while. Not sure what's going on with the Ottomans. Explore is ready. No, it's not exactly ready. He kind of needs to heal up the ships first, I think. Finished our occupation. Good, good, good. And they're fighting separatists again. So they have their army up here, but they're not actually moving on Portugal. For whatever reason. And our subject states, uh, subject state embraced the renaissance. Good for you. It ain't gonna help you now. 
Ain't gonna help you survive. Yeah, I'm gonna annex them right now. I could wait. I could try to get uh, another idea group. Could try to get influence all the way up to here. Uh, but how many points will I pay in the meantime? <laughs> right. So, we're gonna eat them alive right now. That means I don't have to improve relations with them anymore. I can start improving relations with Alodia instead and make them a loyal subject. And for the time being, I'm gonna focus on getting the fleet prepared. Oh boy. Yeah, you just get in here so we can kill these guys while we split the forces. How are you doing? You have actually have transports now. What's the Why would Oh Oh Yeah, now I figure out what's going on. Oh, damn it. 19k too. That's... Okay, so that's what went on there. Arg. Um... My rebels are... Quite... Oh, that's pleasant. Are you gonna go and die on... Against him? Looks like my rebels are gonna go and fight. Um, yeah, fight Molly. Okay, I'm gonna split out these ships a bit. You're gonna go split up as well. Create new unit. Caravan is gonna join the trade protection fleet in the Ivory Coast. The galleons are gonna upgrade if I can afford it. Which I can. So we will. And try to get all the ships together here. Losing money. Yeah, something. Draw the big change to the score there. Oh well. Tanga converted. Very good. Yeah, take this one. And. Just do this, like, so it doesn't rise up while we do that. While we converge. That's Morocco and Klemken. You're only at war with Morocco, that's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wear down this war exhaustion, it's just bad. So we can't fight for a while. Well, thank you, Mali, for taking care of our rebels. That's nice. That's nice of you. Now I have to reclaim these and deal with the next rebellion. There were some on Cape Verde. Yeah, we'll have to send a small detachment there. Well, we can stop over there first. Clear Cape Verde, then we're going to go to sail and deal with this, and then we have to go and sail and deal with that. Hmm. Pesky, pesky rebels. There are still some air separatists. Portuguese separatists, really? Really? That must be up here. Yeah. Oh, it's, it did core already. Oh well, um. Can't do that. Can I march through you? Actually, let's ask our old friend Cusco. Let's just march closer first.
And yeah, now we're gonna have tons of war guardians. I feel safer. Much, much safer. And the Ottomans are still suffering whatever they're suffering. Um, what's going on here? Nogai is fighting Kazakh. They're losing terribly. Uh, so, occupied by Nogai. They seem to be occupying everything, though. Why? Why are they losing? Morgul is attacker and controls Vah. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, that explains that. So, Mr. Rukovich, what are you gonna do? Still, very unwilling to ally anyone. Including me. Minus 80. Okay, so distance between borders has gone down considerably. By me taking Sokoto, I assume having Alodi as a subject state. Yeah, we're getting closer. Yeah, at some point I'll have to fight the Ottomans. I'm just not sure if I'm ready for that now. If I go to war in Mali, I'm fairly certain he's gonna uh, try to enforce peace again. And whatever they're suffering from, whatever it is, I like the fact that they're suffering like this. Because it weakens them. They completely drains their manpower, they have no... Uh, they have tons of mercenaries. Yeah, I really wish I knew what's going on. They must be trapped somewhere. In Nogai, probably. And that's why I don't really want to upset their situation. I like them being this weak. <laughs> Gives me time to grow stronger. Oh well, uh, at any rate, I need a break here, I think. So I'm gonna do that. Thank you for watching.